Mecha, may Hashem give you happiness, health. The parasha of this week, we talk about Noah. Noah, after the destruction of the world, he wanted to relax. So he drank a lot of wine. He became drunk. And then what happened? He took off his clothes and uh, he was naked. And the Torah give him, the Torah don't give him credit. The Torah give him credit at the beginning that he was tzaddik, he was tam, he was the best man of the world. He was the man, the man of the year, okay? But after he got drunk, the Torah gave him a lot of critic, no credit, or what he was, why? What the Torah want to teach you, how much you have to be careful. How much you, you to be careful how you talk, how you behave, what you eat. I mean, you can eat, but don't eat too much. That you have to go to vomit everything. Don't drink too much that you become another person. The Torah wants you to be normal. You want to be happy, I understand. Noah, after all what he saw, he wanted to relax a little bit. There is three ways how to relax. Imuna, we have Imuna and Hashem. You have nothing to worry. Second, you have to be very, very, very calm. Noah was a, a man that he was always calm. So remain calm, calm. Say, third, okay, you can, you can drink, no problem, but not too much. To, eat, to drink too much is no good for you. No problem that you can drink a little bit of wine, but not bottles, not mixed whiskey, wine, da, 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 no good. No, Noah, he was the man of the year, tzaddik, all what you want, all the good titles you can give him, but once he became drunk and he was naked in front of his family, he lost all the credit that the Torah gave him. He lost, because this is not the way how to behave. You know how, how we know the person, how it's worth, if he's calm, and when he drink, what he become. My friend, I remember, I remember, there was a man that he was drinking all the time, drinking, drinking, drinking. And uh, at the end, his wife, she decided to divorce him. She couldn't stand because he was, uh, he was bad with her in front of people when he, when he drink. I promise you, it took me weeks to bring the shalom to the house. And he promised me not to drink. And unfortunately, one day he could he could uh, he could he could he could uh, he could uh, control himself not to drink, and then Bau Hashem, Bau Hashem, suddenly he took the bottle and uh, he told me this, and he said, "I love my wife. I love you too, the wine, but I don't want to divorce." And he put, and he put the bottle back. Well, you see, sometimes you can control yourself if you want. My friend, when, if we want to be close to Hashem, you have to be careful what we eat, what we drink. We have to be careful what we take into our mouth and what it come out of our mouth. This is, when you stand next to a king, you do everything to be clean. So you have to be clean to pray to, to pray to Hashem. Today we need to pray. So to pray, we, have, we must have a clean mouth. And to have a clean mouth, and that's so that we can pray well, we have to be careful what we eat, what we drink, and what it comes out of our work, word, what we talk. We have to be very careful. My friend, I would like that all of us we say Amizmotilim. Shira Malo Tisaina El Harim. May Abu Isa is a man of Nashu Shavaris. Ali Tenamot Alien Shumeha. He nearly knew Isha Shu Israel. Adonashu Mahonis, Ali Mashu Shaka Valera. 
אדוני שמך וקרא שמו נפשך אדוני, לשמור צדיך ובואיך, מעתה ועד העולם, אמן כלל עצמו.